Hi everyone, one short video before I get on the plane and head back to Austin. I've been in Calgary the last couple of days and in Canada for the last week. And I wanted to do a quick video because I'm in Alberta and Alberta now has the strictest setbacks of any of any uh, local government or any government in the world when it comes to big wind and big solar projects. Uh, but before I get to that, if you don't know me, my name is Robert Bryce. I've been writing about, speaking about energy and power for more than 30 years. I've written six books, co-produced two documentaries. I give you the numbers and the facts, not the spin about energy and power. Okay, so what's going on here in Alberta? Well, in February, the Alberta Utilities Commission announced that it is going to an, uh, adopt an agriculture first policy when it comes to alternative energy projects. Um, that means they are going to prevent or prohibit rather uh, the siting of big, uh, big solar and big wind projects on prime ag land. Uh, they also established a 35 kilometer setback. That is the world's most uh, strictest uh, setback requirement for wind and solar. And I, I know this because I've been following this for a very long time. It's unprecedented, really, 35 kilometers. So what is that? It's over 18 miles. Um, it's just pretty, it's, it truly is remarkable. Um, and when the, uh, the provincial government announced this, uh, the, uh, the, the Albertan uh, premier, uh, Daniel Smith, uh, said that uh, Alberta residents, quote, don't want large scale developments to interfere with our province's most beautiful natural features. So this is, you know, a really a, a remarkable uh, development that here in Alberta, obviously a big uh, energy producing province, and it's an enormous province, but the, the, the provincial government is recognizing that local residents don't want these projects near their homes. They don't there and they're going to protect ag land. This is something we're seeing all over the world, but it is clearly the case here in Alberta. Okay, I'll stop there. You know where to find me. I'm on Substack, robertbryce.substack.com. Thanks a lot. See you.